Rochelle Fabi Morgan. In this video, we're going to make a duct tape cloche hat. Now, this style of hat was very popular in the 1920s and 30s. Think Carrie Mulligan in The Great Gatsby. Hats require a little bit more patience than other duct tape crafts, and in addition to your tape, you're going to need something to trace a circle with, either a stencil or the inside of a roll of tape, a grease pencil, also known as a china marker, a pair of detail scissors, a craft knife, and a head form. Now, if you don't have one of these at home, you can use a medium-sized rubber ball. Let's get started. Cut a long strip of tape, at least 30 inches long. Lay it on your table, lengthwise, sticky side facing up. Take the bottom edge and fold it inward approximately half an inch. Take a second strip of tape and place it on top of the first, sticky side facing down. Repeat this four more times so you have a total of five double-sided strips. Make a small double-sided duct tape fabric at least four inches square. Using a stencil or tape roll, trace a circle at least three inches in diameter with the grease pencil. Cut out the circle with a pair of well-oiled detail scissors. Using a craft knife, cut one inch slits into the circle at zero, 90, 180, and 270 degrees. Place the circle on top of the head form. Pull the slits toward each other so they overlap and fit around the form. With long strips of tape, close the slits and extend each strip past the edge of the circle to adhere to the sides of the head form. With the grease pencil, draw an inner circle approximately one inch from the outer edge. Attach a double-sided strip around the edge of the circle. Keep adding strips in rows around the head form. The hat is actually inside out. Press the strips down and around the head form. Then carefully remove the hat. Trim off any excess tape. Pushing from the top, gently reverse the hat so it's right side in. Then place the hat back on the head form. Make a one-sided duct tape fabric directly on your cutting mat and trace a circle with your grease pencil. Be sure it's the same size as your original circle. Cut it out and replace the original circle from the top of the hat. Remove the hat once more from the head form. Cover the back side of the circle with a small strip of tape. The hat is now complete. Well, here it is. I'll give it a try. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it inspires you to make your own duct tape cloche hat. Thanks for watching.